Hi, this is Annie from the QuickBooks team. To make paying your federal and state taxes easier, you'll want to set up tax payment schedules in QuickBooks. This will help you keep track of when they're due. Let's go over how to set up a tax payment schedule for your federal and state taxes. Before you start, you'll need your Federal Employer Identification Number, or EIN, your state account number, your deposit schedule or payment frequency, your contact number and email address. For electronic payments or ePay, you have a QuickBooks Desktop Payroll Enhanced account. You'll also need your bank account information, your EFTPS PIN and password. If you don't have an EFTPS PIN and password, you may need to contact the IRS to register. Go to Employees, select Payroll Taxes and Liabilities, then select Edit Payment Due Dates slash Methods. Select Schedule Payments. Select the state or federal tax you wish to create a schedule for, then select Edit. In this example, we'll select Federal 941, 944, 943. Select your payment method, check, or ePay. Remember, if you want to electronically pay federal or state taxes, you'll need a QuickBooks Desktop Payroll Enhanced subscription. Then select your payment frequency. If you don't know how often you're required to pay your taxes, contact the IRS or your state. If you're setting up a payment schedule for a state tax, you'll need to add your state account number following the suggested format. Next, select ePay Accounts. Review your bank account info. This will be the account we use to debit your taxes. Take note, the bank account details must be the same as the one you have set up in EFTPS. Now you're set. Select Finish. To set up a scheduled payment for your other liabilities, like 401k, wage garnishment, or workers' compensation, select Benefits and Other Payments. Then Continue. Select Edit to set up your scheduled payments. Fill out the necessary details and once completed, select Finish. Note, you won't be able to set up electronic payments for non-tax items. Select Finish Later. Great work! You've successfully set up your scheduled payments. When you're ready to make your tax payments, check out this video, Part 2, How to Pay Payroll Taxes and Liabilities in QuickBooks Desktop Payroll Enhanced.